Hey there, I'm Joe Yakov. And I'm Will Galach. This week, for week three, a question of the week, the question will be, who on the team would you most and least want to date your sister? Let's get it going. Who on this team would you most and least want to date your freshman sister? She's on the volleyball team. Oh my gosh, that is terrible. <laughs> I don't want anybody to date her. Um, yeah, pick one. Least would be uh, Moody, because he's just he's like 28 or something like that. Um, wouldn't want that anywhere around her. Um, most? She's gonna have a sis, probably. Uh, he's a good guy. Um, I'll have to go with Will Glass. Oh my god! <laughs> we got Colin Cummer, hailing from Hastings, Minnesota. Uh, with two decent looking sisters, who on the team would you most want to date? One of them. One of their sisters? One of your sisters. Oh. Um, for my older sister, gotta give that one to Booty. Just Booty. because of the age difference is probably the closest. Thank god, you my younger one? Um, I think, uh, I think Will right here would take good care of her. Really? You think take so? Real good care. Yeah, and who on the team would you least want to date your sister? Both of them? Yeah. Just one um, individual. Danny Pettum. Danny Pettum? Yeah, it's not even close either. <laughs> uh, without a doubt, least would be Colin Cummer. And then, most likely, I would have to say Sam Marshall. Because uh, he's just a... Good guy, he's intelligent and handsome. How about least? Least want to date your sister. Least want to date my yeah. sister. I'd probably go fish for that. Yeah. <laughs> That's so right my stuff. Well, well, hey, no offense, man, no offense. Yeah. <laughs> All right, here we are with veteran coach Jim Mater, Hall of Fame coach Jim Mater. Uh, out of all the players on the team, coach, who would you most and least want to date your granddaughter? Why not my daughter? <laughs> no, uh, I don't have a granddaughter, but I, I would think, uh, I'm going to say uh, Chris Malachy. Most? No. Please? <laughs> maybe know. maybe both ways. Really? I, I, I think he's got uh, both sides to him. I think he'd be a, 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 a good son-in-law. But also a bad one. Well, I don't know. I would say he's, he's kind of on the wild side. Yeah. I, uh, <laughs> Joey out <laughs> What? <laughs> bad? I no, I don't know. I said there aren't many bad characters out here at all. I don't know it would be a bad one. The least first. The least? Yeah. Oh, God. It is a tough one, but uh, you know, I would go with uh, Ekhoff and, and Bach. Just because I know they got some stuff going on, they have a lot of fun. So I don't know if it's too much fun. And I like to have fun too, and I, that could be some trouble. Um, Least, I would say uh, Ben Albert. Can't trust the guy right there. The guy who I would want to date my daughter. Uh, I'll keep in the quarterback room. Go Jackson or Chris Bax. Tie there. So, head coach Gary Fashion. 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 First of all, you just want to get the names right. Yeah. You sure. Yeah. Okay. Wow. <laughs> Who on this team, yeah. a lot of good guys, would you most and least want to date your daughter? Ooh, I gotta think about this. Uh, so, I've sent be a fine, upstanding guy, so he eliminates you guys. <laughs> I couldn't say you. I, couldn't say you. Um, I think Erdman would be probably, although, you know, his hairstyle wouldn't necessarily be my. It's gotta go. Yeah, but uh, he's a heck of a good guy. Um, and then let's pick out a defensive guy. You know, I think Caribou might not be a bad guy. Uh, yeah. You know, he seems like a good guy to me. He's always, he just walked that. by my door and said hi to me. I like that. So. Yeah. How about least? Least? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> uh, is that really part of the question? Oh, yeah, okay. Um, well, uh, defensively right away, I'd have to go with Bob. <laughs> <laughs> I just, uh, I think, you know, Jackson, he, uh, he seems like he's got a great sense of humor, but I question some of his motives maybe sometimes. Uh, an offensive guy? Um, and I can't say you, right? <laughs> you are gonna. <laughs> I was gonna, right? Yeah. Um, offensive guy? Hmm, maybe. Well, not that he's a bad guy, but. 
gonna say green heck. Okay. Because he, he's kind of yeah, a. That's a right. Yeah. 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 So. Yeah. Here we have Ted K K K K Kalina, and he does have a sister. I do. What's Who would you most oh. and least want to date her? You can take a Oh, thanks. I would most like Adam Ricketts to date my sister. We have a good bond, me and Adam. Um, I think he'd treat her really well. He's a good guy. Least like... Hmm. Maybe you. Huh? Probably Joey Ekoff. Or Bob. Oh. I just, I don't trust either of them, so I don't know. Thank you. At least want to date your sister. Uh, least date my sister would be Chris Malachy. I think the reasons are obvious. I don't think he'd take the relationship very seriously or respect her. Uh, can't make too many fart jokes. Uh, most date my sister is Ben Barch. Just a stand-up guy all around. It's perfect amount of funny and nice. And uh, yeah, you most and least want to date your sister. Oh, most and least. All right, I'll go. I'll go least first. Um, I gotta go with Bach. <laughs> uh, <laughs> I just don't know if I can do it. If I can come over to Bach, it just, I, I just don't think I'd be able to do it. <laughs> Personally, I don't know. Uh, but most, I might have to go with my guy, Willie G, here. Super respectful. Uh, good works team. I mean, I, fi I figured he'd do good works with my sister, too. <laughs> James Inman here. Alright. Who on the team would you most and least want to date your sister? Uh, least is pretty easy. I'm not going to get into any details, but I would pick Tommy OJ. He's been saying some really weird things in our apartment lately, and I just wouldn't like him around any of my family members. Um, who I'd most like to date my sister is probably Ted Kalina. Um, he's been a really stand-up guy lately. He's had some down times um, in the past. Hasn't been too good of a guy before, but lately. I think he's he's a really good guy, especially when he's on his paleo diet. <laughs> Would you least and most want to date your sister? Um, least likely, I'd have to say Stephen Fisher. He's just a little too smooth. Don't know if I can trust him. Okay, call him. Um, most likely would have to be Max Jackson. Just an all-around great guy. Two absolute beauties just showed up about four minutes before practice. Good guys. We got a question for you. Who would you most and least want to date your sister? We'll start with least, Will Glatch. Uh, greasy, don't trust him worth anything. Least booty, he's old. It's kind of, that'd be kind of creepy. I'll go Jimmy Inman. Jimmy Inman's a pretty good, well-rounded guy, so he's my most, would most want. Yeah. All right, Max. A couple minutes till practice. Quick question: <laughs> Who on this team would you most and least want to date your sister? Uh, most, I'd say Sam Westby. Uh, least, I'm sure a lot of people said Will Glatch, but I mean, I think he's got the whole whole world tricked. Um, I don't buy any of the shenanigans that he pulls. Good works team and all, but. Um, least, I'd probably say Will. Hey there, I'm Joey. And I'm Will. <laughs> Welcome to week three of Question of the Week. <laughs>